Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome to Artistic Intention Studios. Don't know why that doesn't want to focus. Tell you what, my phone <laughs> and I have been in a lot of arguments here lately. Um, today I thought I would do a tree ring pour. And I've already got my colors layered in the cup. I have had a lot of questions lately about my paint colors, specific colors. Um, so I thought I would go run through that real quick. Uh, the white I'm using today is this, this Dutch Boy interior paint. Um, it's just a basic white. That is mixed with Floetrol and water. The gold that I've been using lately is this amazing Deco Art Extreme Sheen 24 karat gold. I'm also using a purple. Um, this is the Master's Touch brand. It's from Hobby Lobby. It's their basic acrylic paint. This is color is violet. And then I have a teal color, a light teal. It's actually ocean green, also Master's Touch. And then, oh yeah, and Payne's Gray. This was uh, actually a Liquitex brand. Okay. So I hope that was informative for you. I will put those in the description as well. Um, sorry I haven't been doing that. I just, I don't know, kind of figured it didn't matter so much. But if people want it, I'll give it to them. So I'm just going to try really hard to do a nice, slow tree ring. I've uh, layered these. I started with white and then went to gold. Um, and then the Payne's gray, and then the teal, and then the purple. That's how I layered it. And I did that like three times just to get plenty of paint. Because I want to try to really get these rings stretched out as much as possible, as close to the edges as possible before I ever even start tilting. Might waste a lot of paint that way, but I think I can kind of maintain my rings a little better, hopefully. I just, I don't have a whole lot of patience, <laughs> so this is a little tough for me <laughs> to do the nice and slow study, so sometimes I get to go in faster and the rings change sizes. I'm going to raise the cup up for a little variation on the rings. We are getting some nice ring form formations and still got quite a bit of paint in the cup so I'm just going to keep going. Hopefully this will turn out to be a good one. Oh, I don't have the patience for this. <laughs> there we go. All right. Just gonna try to slowly tilt. Try to keep the, these ring formations intact as much as possible. So I'm doing like kind of a rotation of the canvas. By the way, this is a 12 by 12 canvas. Don't think I mentioned that. That gold is so pretty. It just sparkles in there. what 
I'm doing sitting down, so. Go over to the corners. So it looks like that purple's really taken over. I'm hoping some of that gold comes back. It seems to be felt like I put a lot in there, but it's not turning out that way. I really like this right here, so I'm going to try to save that. I'm going to try to pull that back. I love all the banding in here. It looks like a stone formation, like a geode, sort of. Okay, and then we just got this one last corner over here. And there's some pretty gold. I really don't want to run that all off. I might have saved some of it. I don't know. So now I'm trying to pull that center back. edges and corners. Right over here. And just wanna... Okay. I am going to pause you and bring you in for a close up. So hang on guys. Okay, we are back. This did not really turn out as expected. Um, there's a lot of cells popping up. There was no silicone in this. Just the paints, Floetrol, and water. So there's a lot of cells popping up. And a lot of purple. There is some gold here and there. So I think when that dries, that's really going to kind of sparkle. Um, that teal just kind of got lost. I really don't see much. There's a lot more gold down here. You can kind of see it sparkling. So I think that's going to be cool when it dries. Actually, this whole corner over here is really pretty cool. I like that a lot. There's some gold in there. Yeah, so... Mostly purple and gray. <laughs> kind of weird. Yeah, but not too bad. Interesting lines and when you when you zoom in, it's really cool, but I don't know. As an overall piece, I'm not not really sure how I feel about it. But it is what it is. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, leave me some comments. And come back and see me again real soon. Till next time, guys.